Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we have an online battle and it is actually the first round of the Rubicon Casual Tournament which was hosted by Worse Says and a few other guys on the, their Steam group um, on the 18th of January 2014. So this is my first round match. I am playing as the Iceni tribe and my opponent is called Zed and he is playing as the, well, as Bactria. And you might be wondering, why did I pick Iceni against Bactria? Well, I'm not very good at uh, online battles. I'm very inexperienced compared to other people. And I noticed that with the tournament because I did actually look at some of the profiles of some of the players that competed in this tournament. And some of them have got 400, 500 hours. No word of a lie, 400, 500 hours of Total War Rome 2 experience. Whereas I've, I've only got about 90, 91, I think it is, at this moment in time. So, yeah, they've played the game about four or five times more than me. So I kind of expected to not do very well in this tournament, and I know this is this is this is actually spoiling the video a little bit at the moment because um, I don't proceed in this tournament as <laughs> as I expected. But I can take heart in the fact that the guy that beat me, Zed, in this battle now, which we'll, you'll see, he actually went all the way to the semi-final. So congratulations to Zed for getting that far, and I think he actually lost to Agony Red who ended up winning the tournament so you know it's not bad I lost to somebody who got the semi-final and he lost to somebody who actually won the tournament so who knows <laughs> on another day I might have done better but anyway let's go through the battle so uh, this is my build I actually tried out this build uh, in a couple of online multiplayer battles you've probably seen me play in on my channel lately I picked the Icini only because my online battles I've probably got the best record with the Icini. I think I've only lost one or two battles and I've used them about six or seven times. So I felt pretty confident to use them. No matter who I was against, I was always going to pick this this uh, this faction. Maybe the Rome, Rome or the Seleucids or Sparta might have done better against Bactria, but I wanted to go with Icini. I've got my slingers, two units of slingers, two units of javelin men, got six units of heroic nobles. I have my Noble Cavalry and I have four units of Spearmen. So the rules of the tournament were that you could only have six um, elite infantry units, which I have. You could have, you couldn't have, you couldn't have more than 12 infantry altogether. I have 10 altogether if you include my Spearmen. And you couldn't have more than, I think it was eight cavalry, but I have four. So you had to kind of build your, your army within the limitations, which is to keep the tournament fair, of course, because you can't, you can't just spam more elephants and cataphracts and stuff. So here we go, so sh straight away he's going towards my right flank with his skirmisher cavalry. I probably should have stayed back a bit rather than attack him, but I have to I have to probably give you the kind of backstory of this battle. Um, it did take a while t for the tournament to get going. I was in the chat, we had to get into the chat about half a, 15 minutes to half an hour before the tournament started at 5 o'clock and I didn't actually fight this battle until about 6 o'clock. I had to wait for an hour because initially I was supposed to have a bye and I was going to be in the second round um, but uh, there was a few um, issues with the with the tournament draw a couple of people pulled out I think and they had to kind of change things around so people would be would be playing so I ended up being moved to the first round but I didn't get to, to play for like an hour so I was a little bit impatient when I started this battle so I went right and out straight away as you can see charging up the left flank with my cavalry charge up the right flank with my cavalry uh, I bring my my center forward. I should have concentrated on the center. That's my, that's my biggest mistake in this battle. And the thing is, I am against tough, tough, experienced opposition in this, in this battle. Somebody who went, like I said, to the semi-final of this competition, and yeah, I noticed he had elephants, which I, w I wanted to avoid as, as much as possible. So I was trying to draw him out. I was hoping to try and draw his flanks out. If I could have weakened his centre by pulling units away, which sort of worked on my right flank, as you can see, he got about four units chasing my two units of cavalry on the right flank. But my centre, I wasn't really paying much attention, so they are kind of well, they're about to be enveloped by by his uh, units. So my cavalry's jumping in right now to his uh, Scythian horse, horse archers. I couldn't say that then, <laughs> and I kind of first bloods to me, as you can see, I've routed that first unit, and all, and all of a sudden. I'm thinking, wow, could I actually do this? Could I actually upset the odds? <laughs> I'm only joking, I didn't think that at all. Um, I was probably thinking, oh my god, how, how much longer can I hold on for? 
it's different when you're like I, I can look back now and have a bit of a laugh about this but at the time you, you know you are quite serious you are quite pumped about fighting these type of battles you want to not embarrass yourself and you want to to give a good show basically and to to not embarrass yourself and that's kind of what happened look at this elephant the elephant's just gone straight through my center he couldn't resist the opportunity to charge my center i left them open my spearmen weren't brought up quick enough and i just didn't commit enough men and i'm getting completely owned at the moment on my left flank look at that four units route in straight away in a matter of seconds uh, I got all my cavalry grouped together, which is quite a positive thing, but I wasn't able to use it. I was open to try and charge his general, but there we go. As soon as he puts the buffs on, I've lost like five units. And that's somebody who knows what they're doing with online battles, somebody who's experienced, and somebody who knows how to use the unit buffs and take all the advantages. I was hoping to make a run for his general. He's looking at that. He moved his general out the way, so I couldn't get to them with my cavalry. And then again, all of a sudden, I'm outflanked with my cavalry then. And that's basically the battle. <laughs> my cavalry gets outflanked behind his lines. The, the units I have left in the centre will eventually break. He's able to just charge him with everything now. And it's uh, probably a fairly easy win for him. But, you know, I can take heart. This was my first ever online tournament. My first ever tournament where I got to compete against the best. And it was an enjoyable experience. And hopefully I can do this again and can showcase some more battles like this on my channel again but i'm going to end the, the video there i will leave you with the loaded screen as you can see i say well done to my opponent there in the chat i've been dragonheart hope you've enjoyed this online battle and this tournament until next time goodbye